notes for Ted's and music gloves and welcome back to my channel. I have some guests here today. I'm going to sort my family into the Hogwarts houses and mum's wearing her Ravenclaw diadem necklace. So you are supposedly a Ravenclaw. Am I? But last time I sorted my family. Mum became a Ravenclaw, Hannah became a Hufflepuff and dad also we came up above. And I'm a Gryffindor. Do you guys want to introduce yourselves? Hello, I'm Dad. Hello, I'm Maya's sister. My name is Hannah. And I'm Maya's and Hannah's mother. We have the computer. I'm going to go on to Pottermore. Dad is going to start. <laughs> First question, Dad. Okay. Dawn or dusk? Um, dusk. Next question. Yes? Once every century, the Flutterby bush produces flowers that adapt their scent to attract the unwary. If it lured you, it would smell of a crackling log fire, the sea, fresh parchment, or home. Home. You're going for home? Yeah. If you could have any power, which would you choose? Power to read minds, the power of invisibility, the power of superhuman strength, the power to speak to animals, the power to change the past, or the power to change your appearance that will. Superhuman strength. Yes. Which nightmare would frighten you the most? Standing on top of something very high and realizing suddenly that there are no hand or footholds, nor any barrier to stop you from falling. An eye at the keyhole of the dark, windowless room in which you are locked. Waking up to find that neither your friends nor your family have any idea who you are or being forced to speak in such a silly voice that hardly anyone can understand you and everyone laughs at you the first one the heights are you scared of heights yeah. which of the following do you find most difficult to deal with hunger cold loneliness boredom or being ignored being being ignored okay why <laughs> because I hate to being ignored. Is it something you experience daily? No, I don't, I don't <laughs> experience it daily, but uh, okay. that would be... It wouldn't be nice to be ignored all the time. It's very true. If you were attending Hogwarts, which pet would you choose to take with you? Tabby cat, Siamese cat, ginger cat, black cat, white cat, tawny owl, screech owl, brown owl, snowy owl, barn owl, common toad, natterjack toad. <laughs> Do you know what that is? No. No. <laughs> Dragon toad, harlequin toad, or three toad, tree toad. Say that three times really three fast. Toad, three toad. Faster. <laughs> black cat. Is it because we have a black cat? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Next question. How would you like to be known to history? The wise, the good, the great, or the bold? <laughs> The huh? bald? <laughs> Mum! The bald? Or is very accurate, really, because you got a haircut today, didn't you, Dad? Yes. Show them your haircut. Yeah. <laughs> you're Perfect. already You're already bald. Holiday haircut. <laughs> so do you want to be bald? <laughs> wise, good, or great? Great. Great. Black or white? Choose wisely. Uh, black. Nay! No. <laughs> oh! <laughs> What a plot twist. You're a Slytherin, Dad. How this is wrong. From Hufflepuff to Slytherin. Hold this. Show it to the camera. <laughs> so Dad isn't a Hufflepuff anymore. I'm not Hufflepuff. He's officially a Slytherin. It's the first Slytherin in our family. Very strange, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Aren't you happy? No. It's no. a great house. I'm a bit scared. <laughs> Slytherin, that's uh, Draco and all the you, other bastards. You can't... <laughs> Um, you can't Why? be stereotypical because on my channel we love all houses because no. all houses make no. up Hogwarts. Not Slytherin. <laughs> yes, Slytherin. <laughs> I have friends who are Slytherin. You do? Yeah, lots of people. So many nice Slytherins as well. <laughs> Dad! <laughs> no, don't cry! That's great! Yeah, I'm a bit uh, shocked. Do you shocked. want to be Hufflepuff? <laughs> yes. Well, well, what's the house? What's the one house you really want to be in? Gryffindor. Yeah. You're, you're a Gryffindor. I'm a Gryffindor. All Harry houses. Is Gryffindor. Yeah. Slytherins, they're, you know, I mean, it's Draco and his father. <laughs> it's Draco and his father. What yeah. more could you ask for? Snape. Yeah. Yeah. They're not good people. Yeah, they are. Well, not Lucius. Snape is a really good person or was a really good person. Mm -hmm. I think you should be proud that that's your house. Okay. Slytherin. <laughs> yeah. Get, get used to, to saying weird. that. Okay. Okay. Thank you. It's your turn, Hannah. <laughs> this will be very embarrassing if I'm not a Hufflepuff because I'm wearing a yeah, because you have shirt. Hufflepuff merch. <laughs> and that's really awkward if I'm not. Yeah, but you got my hat. Yeah. I can't have that hat anymore. You need to buy one in <laughs> Slytherin colors, Dad. <laughs> Green clothes. 
Mm. I think this is so exciting. A bit nervous again. I don't know what if I am slithering too. You don't have to be nervous, it's a great house. Okay. The traits are ambition, cunning, and determination. It's great. It's not all bad, guys. You need to be open minded. All right. All right. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. She has, she has my Hufflepuff hat now. Are you sad? Yes, a bit. I can't wear it anymore. <laughs> you can borrow it if you want to. No, I don't want to. I'm a Slytherin. Yeah, that's right. Be proud. Moon or stars? It's different questions. Yeah? <laughs> I like the moon and I like the stars. You know, which one do you like the most? Which one do you prefer? I don't know. Maybe the stars. Maybe. It's going to take a lot of time, this one. <laughs> yeah. Four goblets are placed before you, which would you choose to drink? The foaming, frothing, silvery liquid that sparkles as though containing ground diamonds. The smooth, thick, richly purple drink that gives a delicious smell of chocolate and plums. The golden liquid so bright that it hurts the eye, which makes sunspots dance all around the room. The mysterious black liquid that gleams like ink and gives off fumes that make you see strange visions. I wouldn't drink that one. They didn't have milk? No. No. The first one because it, it sounded... It contains diamonds. Yeah. Uh, which of the following do you find most difficult to deal with? Hunger, cold, loneliness, boredom, being ignored. I feel like no, no one likes you. One <laughs> Ouch! No one wants to be ignored. This no. isn't meant to be. Meant uh, which to be which one easy, is the which one know. is the most difficult to deal with? I don't know. I mean, I would say boredom <laughs> because you're such a social creature, social butterfly. That's okay, what you are. Okay. What are you most looking forward to learning at Hogwarts? Apparition and this apparition being able to materialize and dematerialize. Transfiguration, turning object into another object. Flying on a broomstick, excess and jinxes. All about magical creatures what and else? how to befriend, care for them. Uh, secrets about the castle. Every area of magic I can. Every area of magic I can. Yes. Then you can do all of things. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I know. Uh, given the choice, would you rather invent Potion that would guarantee you love, glory, wisdom, power, and wisdom. Mm -hmm. uh, the next question is One of your housemates has cheated in a Hogwarts exam by using a self spelling quill. Now he has come top of the class in charms beating you into second place. Professor Flitwick is suspicious of what happened. He draws you to one side after his lesson and asks you whether or not your classmate used the forbidden quill. What do you do? So would you lie and say you don't know, but hope that somebody else tells Professor Flitwick the truth? Tell Professor Flitwick that he ought to ask your classmate and resolve to tell your classmate that if he doesn't tell the truth, you will. Tell Professor Flitwick the truth. If your classmate is prepared to win by cheating, he deserves to be found out. Also, as you are both in the same house, any points he loses will be regained by you for coming first in his place. You would not wait to be asked to tell Professor Flitwick the truth. If you knew that somebody was using a forbidden quill, you would tell the teacher before the exam started. It's a hard question. I, I wouldn't threaten anyone, but I would like you have to tell this because it's good if you, if you tell the truth. Tell Professor Flitwick that you ought to ask your classmate. Yeah, because I, I, I don't want the problems on me. Okay. If you were attending Hogwarts, which pet would you choose to take with you? I take the type of cat. Heads or tails? It's a 50-50 question, Anna. <laughs> it's just like it's black so and difficult. white. <laughs> I think it's difficult. Tails. <laughs> <laughs> Show him what you got! Oh. Show him what you got! <laughs> Gryffindor! Are you happy? No. I have to take it off! <laughs> no, I, I have done this test before and I am... Um, I was a Hufflepuff. So I think this is really unfair. You are a Hufflepuff. I am a true Hufflepuff. You are a Gryffindor. No. Mom's turn. You should be 007 Gryffindor. You love James Bond. Yeah. 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 Perfect. <laughs> I can put it on. It's more suitable to you. Okay. We don't have any Slytherin uh, shirts here. I'm really sad right now. I'm in a bit of shock myself. We need a hug. Mm -hmm. Expelliamos.
Armus. Expelliarmus, not Armos. Accio. Accio what? Uh, everything. <laughs> that. <laughs> Avada Kedavra. Nay. Don't kill each other. <laughs> Stupid muggles. What are they doing? I don't know. I can't see them over there. <laughs> Blue moss. <laughs> guys. Oh, okay. guys. I'm going to start to eat your dirty pots candies here. Try one, Dad. I, I have the elder like one. Shit, I suppose. I have the elder one. I, I, I remember this scene. Where all the marks do like this. Name. You know who? Yeah, you know who. You know who? He's he he does like this in, in uh, you know when he duels. Where when he kills, uh, you know, uh, Edward. I'm doing the same pose. Okay, very good. What are you guys saying? <laughs> we don't know really. No. We we we're, we're, we're just we're, rambling. We're just thinking loud. <laughs> I I don't want this shirt. I'm a true Hufflepuff. Uh, you're taking over my channel. Yeah, okay. we're like the yeah. same person. Me and Dad. I could be falling in love, falling in love, falling in love. I could be You've not got a joy. Falling I in love. I don't you think so. Are you ashamed? Ranger. <laughs> that is out of tune. Yeah. So oh, I better not join. Oh, Ranger. You're ready. Ranger. Mm -hmm. As ready as can be. Eliza and Peggy, Peggy. Skylar sister Angelica mm -hmm. Peggy Eliza Work Are work, we done? Work, work, yeah Yeah Dawn or dusk? Dawn What are you most looking forward to learning at Hogwarts? Apparition and disapparition Being able to materialise and dematerialise at will Transfiguration Turning one object into another object Flying on a broomstick Hexes and jinxes All about magical creatures and how to befriend slash care for them Secrets about the castle Or every area of magic I can Mm, the last one. The last one? Yes. That's me. Yes. This one is really hard. A troll has gone berserk in the headmaster's study at Hogwarts. It is about to smash, crush and tear several irreplaceable items and treasures. In which order would you rescue these objects from the troll's club if you could? Oh. I think I would start with the uh, cure for dragon pox mm -hmm. because there are still dragons and not that many left in the world so it's good to save them I think. Then the sjukdom för trollkarar. I thought it was for dragons. <laughs> no. Do you well, have anyway. rack spurts in your head? No, I left <laughs> that for you, you darling. Put, okay. Do we have any rack spurts? Can I see the ones in my own head? No, you can't. Do you see any rack spurts in any of us? No, it was one. It was going away from, <laughs> from my wife's head right now, but it's gone now. Yeah, it went over to you. <laughs> yeah, probably. What's going on? That one. Dragon Fox. This one? Mm. So Dragon Fox. Handwritten book and then the Student records. Student records. Yeah. Yeah. Good order. Four goblets are placed before you. Which would you choose to drink? I want the chocolate one. The chocolate one. Yeah. The chocolate and plum one. Mm -hmm. You like plums? Uh, I like to eat them. Yeah. But when they're fresh. <laughs> yeah. But I don't like uh, jam and things like that. That one sounds the more delicious one. Yeah. I think so too. You and two friends need to cross a bridge guarded by a river troll who insists on fighting one of you <laughs> before he will let all of you pass. Do you attempt to confuse the troll into letting all three of you pass without fighting? Suggest drawing lots to decide which of you will fight. Suggest that all three of you should fight without telling the troll. Volunteer to fight. I think I picked the first one. Outsmart yeah. the troll. Maybe. In my head. Two of them. Which house do you think you'll be sorted into? I have no idea. By the way. I don't know. I think she will I, be I a I think Raven I will Clark. be a Hufflepuff because no, the other ones you can weren't. be. I, I don't want you to be a Hufflepuff. And then I got a cap and a shirt yeah, to wear. Perfect. It's perfect. <laughs> I think you're going to be Ravenclaw. You do? I think so. Mm -hmm. I want to be Hufflepuff. Okay. After but you have died. Are you okay, Hannah? And she no. was sad when you said after I have died. Yeah. Yeah, no, I think so too. I, I, I cried because I'm, I'm not a Hufflepuff <laughs> in this video. <laughs> Weren't sad really when I died. Okay, but mum. Yeah. After you have died, mm -hmm. what would you most... What would you most like people to do when they hear your name? Miss you but smile? Ask for more stories about your adventures? Think with admiration of your achievements? Or, I don't care what people think of me after I'm dead. It's what they think of me while I'm alive that counts. Oh. Hmm. Either that oh, one God. or the first one. No, I, I pick the first one. Miss you but smile. Mm -hmm. That would be nice. If you are attending Hogwarts, which <laughs> pet... 
Which pet would you choose to take with you? I don't want any toad. I do think you want it an would owl? be really cool with an owl. Yeah, because we love owls, don't we? Yeah, we do. So what owl? Which one? I pick the tawny. Left or right? Left mm. or right, Mum? It's even more difficult than black or black or white was much easier. No. But Dad got that one and then Hannah you got have... heads or tails. Yes. That's really hard. Yeah, that's difficult. I pick right. Okay, why? What's your motivation behind it? right handed. You're right handed. <laughs> yeah! Oh! Oh my god. I've sorted my entire family into Hogwarts houses. No. I'm truly feeling like a Hufflepuff. Uh, Mum's a Ravenclaw. Hannah, Hannah is a Hufflepuff. Is a Gryffindor. Hufflepuff. Gryffindor. <laughs> Hufflepuff. Gryffindor. No. And Dad is a Slytherin. No. No. <laughs> Slytherin. No. Th that's not good, my Can you stop hating on Slytherin? Guys, you've been sorted. How yes. do you how do you feel about this whole experience? Awful. Did you enjoy it? No. Did you, did you like it? No. <laughs> Stop being so negative. I think I'm Hufflepuff. Okay, fair enough. But if you are, then we are all of the houses in one family and I think that's beautiful. Isn't that lovely? It is. Fantastic. <laughs> Do you want to say anything to the camera, to no. my lovely viewers? Thank you for subscribing. Be quiet and calm. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. And what type of animals carry post and mail in the wizarding world, Dad? One, uh... two, three. Pigeons. Pigeons. Nice, nice. Pigeons. No, 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 no. It was the. You know, what, what are they called? They're called the. Uh... Look at that shelf. The owls. Yeah. Uh -huh. Well done, I Dad. Was, I wasn't thinking about the owls. I was Anna, thinking about... try those glasses again <laughs> and see about... if it's got any of these. Rack spurts. Yes. What are they called? The other ones. <laughs> <laughs> what? Niffler? He, no. He no. has like a file them. of them. Hippogriffs. Like, no, I'm li uh, like... Um, Phoenix. No, what's the little one? Dobby. <laughs> House elves? Yeah. <laughs> Just thinking Can about they them. Fly? That's even worse than pigeons because pigeons are actually birds. Yes, they're birds. Yeah, owls are birds too. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, I think we need to wrap this up before it just becomes complete chaos. Thank you for being in my video. Thank You're you. Welcome. Yeah, Thank you. hopefully we can do more videos together. This is really fun. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. And remember to stay nerdy, stay pottery, and dad, take it away. Be yourself. Stay yourselves. <laughs> stay yourselves. Nelly. And <laughs> and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, Bye everyone! Bye-bye!